Hi everyone. 您好 Welcome to Smart Mandarin. Focus on characters. 我是 Maggie. 您好吗 If this is your first time to visit our channel, please subscribe. This is what we believe is the best way to learn Mandarin. So far, we have introduced some concepts of Chinese characters, strokes, pictograms, and radicals. Pictograms is one of the three main types of Han characters. Today, we are going to introduce the other type of Han characters, ideograms. And next time, we are going to introduce semantic phonograms. There are two types of ideograms. The first one is simple, structured, and intuitive, like this one, shang. If we refer this line as a surface. And this part is above. Shang, zhong means middle. We can refer this stroke is in the center. Xia, if we refer this to surface, and the main part is below. Shang, zhong, xia. Now let's get on with these characters. Shang means above. Top, upper, and also means to go up or to go to. For example, 上海 literally means go to the sea. 上 Let's see how to write it. 一二三 Three strokes. Let's practice together. 一二三上中 It means middle, center. Also means a mid and medium. Zhong. Let's see how to write it. One, two, three, four. Four strokes. Let's practice together. One, two, three, four. Zhong. Xia. It means below, under. Also means lower, later, and going down. 下一二三 three strokes. Let's do together. 一二三下 The other example is this one. 半 It means half. 半一二三四 Five strokes. Let's practice together. One, two, three, four, five, half. Ping. It means flat, calm, and common. Ping. This character is very similar to ban, half. So we can imagine that this is a surface. It looks really flat. So it is flat and calm. Ping. Let's look at how to write it. One, two, three, four, five. Five strokes. Let's practice together. One, two, three, four, five. Ping. Flat. This character ban we can refer this line as the root of this tree, meaning root or origin. Ban. One, two, three, four, five. Also five strokes. Let's write together. One, two, three, four, five. Ben. Now let's look at these two characters. The shape are the opposite. This one is ao. It means concave, and the two means convex. Ao tu. Let's see how to write it. One, two, three, four, five. 
Let's practice together. E R San Si Wu Ao Tu E R San Si Wu Let's practice together. E R San Si Wu Five strokes. Two. Did you know that most simple ideograms are also radicals? For example, we can find the drawing in both these two characters, and here we have drawing middle on the top and the heart at the bottom, and in this character we say drawing on the right side. They all pronounce drawing. This one means Loyu and this drone means clock. But most of the ideograms are compound characters. It means they have two or more components in one character, as we have learned. Zhong, there are two parts. Zhong, there are three radicals. The other example is Ming. Ming has two radicals. The left one is the sun, Zhi, and the right side is the moon, Yue, and it means bright and also tomorrow, Ming. And also we learned this character Hao. The idea is a woman, Nü, and a child, Zi. Together is Hao. Okay, today we introduced another concept of Han characters, ideograms, like Shang, Zhong, Xia. They are simple ideograms and compound ideograms. The simple ideograms are also radicals of other characters. That's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you want to continue to develop your writing and reading skills, my book "Writing Chinese Characters" now is available at eBay. 谢谢，再见。If you like our video, please give us a thumb up and subscribe. See you next time.